Hey everyone, this is Paul here from Gamemori, and today I'm gonna show you how to paint a Love Dragon Easter egg. First, you wanna wash the egg with soap and water thoroughly. Once that's done, we need to puncture a hole on top of the egg and a little bit bigger hole on the bottom of the egg. After that, you can blow the egg out from the small hole to the big hole into a container. Once that's done, you wanna rinse out the inside of the egg by letting some water in there and blowing it out. Before painting, what you want to do is pre-draw the pattern that you're planning to do. This way, if you make mistakes, it's much easier to correct than it is with the paint. Once you're done with your outlines, you want to take an eraser and erase the lines that you don't want to use. And this way all you have left is the fine lines that you're going to follow with your brush. At this point we're ready to paint. The first thing that you want to paint around is the shape of the heart. Since we're using water-based paint, if for any reason you make a mistake and you go inside the heart, you can just rinse it off with water and start over. Once you're done painting around the heart, you can just use larger strokes to paint the rest of the surface of the egg the same color. You don't really need to worry about the bubbles that's left by the brush. As the paint dries, it will clear up. Once the first layer of paint has dried, you can go to the next step by painting in the fine lines with a darker color. By now you probably get the idea, so I'm going to speed up the video to get through the rest of this portion a little faster. After this layer of the paint has dried also, what we want to do next is we want to fill the heart in with a solid color.
After we're done filling in the heart with the solid color, we want to try to apply a little bit more paint on the edge of the heart to create a transition that will make it look like the edge of the heart is a little darker and the inside of the heart is a little lighter. Once we're done with this part, what we can do is to make the transition even more visible, we can dip the brush into water and just take back some of the paint from the inside of the heart, from the middle of the heart. Once the paint has dried on the heart as well, the next step we're going to do is paint our outline of the heart in. Now for this we're going to use a fine brush and we're going to use a darker color as well. You probably got the idea by now, so I'm going to speed up this portion of the video as well. At this point you can apply some acrylic sealer to the egg to make it nice and glossy, but do it in several applications because this can make the paint run as well. After that just let it dry and you have yourself a beautiful one-of-a-kind easter egg.